hello everyone uh, this video is all about um, the search bar with suggestion and filter okay so first of all it will provide you the suggestion whenever you are writing something in this input field then it will filter the data okay so let's get started okay um, this is the demo let's for example write something in okay I have limited this uh, um, suggestion okay until five you can add like for example like YouTube okay how YouTube suggest you just a few um, sentences or a few uh, search history okay but uh, I also um, just uh, um, uh, placed five uh, um, suggestion here okay we can increase the uh, number of this suggestion also so I press in so it suggested me like let's write for example e it's suggesting me these uh, let's press one of them see why I press this so it has came inside the input fields then we can press and search the data so it is all about that we will do in this video okay so now let's get started so this is the uh, we can say the react app okay which i have created so this is the app.js6 we will write our code here and i wrote some css uh, design okay just these through for app uh, for search and also drop down content later we will add the drop down content do element so now let's get said what we will do first of all we will add input field and a search button so let's start so here we will add in input field and we will add a value before this add a button also search okay now let's just uh, come here on change okay whenever we change this input field it means we are writing something in this world we will call on change function let's create the on change function now const on change is equal to we will get an event So we, here we will get the value we are writing inside this input field. So now we will store that in a state variable. Let's create a state variable. Const value set value. Set value is used to update the value. Use state hook. Okay. We will use use state hook. Now let's just update our value. Okay. Uh, we will just call set value. And we will assign e dot target dot value. So what it will do it will just update this value so after uh, uh, storing the uh, video we are writing in input field inside this value now let's assign it to the input field because we want we will we need it value now let's display the records okay whenever we write something we should fetch the records so for the fetching records I will just fetch the record okay this search bar I will fetch records from this JSON placeholder API I will fetch these titles okay these titles from these are posts and I will pick just the titles so let's get started so whenever I write something in this input field okay I will start searching the data so just come here in under this okay I will just write the fetch API const response is equal to fetch we will use fetch API okay and here um, I will just assign this URL let's write it inside this and also I will make it async and uh, await keyword I will add them asynchronous okay and just come here right here the await keyword now let's uh, whenever we get the response we will change that to the JSON format cons data is equal to response dot JSON format okay what we will do after then we will store this data inside as another state variable okay so let's create one another state variable const data set data by default we will assign an array to this because it is in array a list with us okay a list of records let's call now set uh, data okay set data and there we will assign the data that we pitched now right now okay we will assign this to this data now let's display the records okay whenever we write something in this input field we will display the records in drop down okay just come here under this view i will create one another view element and i will assign a class name uh, drop down down content as we wrote some css code for that okay drop down content and here i will use map function to display the data okay just come here data dot map and here we will get uh, um, the item uh, what we have here we, I will display the records okay inside this div element so to display the record we should assign a key to this uh, first child okay key is equal to with item dot id and here I will um, display the records let's write 
item dot title let's save it and now let's move okay to the browser what happens see let's write something here it's nothing let's write yeah sorry we faced with an error okay let's check it let's move to the console Uh, data dot map is not a function okay let's check it okay we never we write something unchange we call unchange function value is equal to value data dot map is not a function okay it means that there is no data inside this data set data we should make it uh, a weight okay we should make it a weight let's see it now let's come here appreciate and now let's write something here yeah the data has pitched okay these are the titles that we fixed okay we have uh, 200 um, titles now let's uh, ad just add um, a line under every every title okay just I will use HR tag horizontal line okay it looks like this. these are the titles with us let's close it so now what we will do, we will limit it okay for example um, there are uh, ha, uh, tens records which which uh, starts with e okay uh, let's write um, it is not i think pitching let's appreciate what happened yeah let's no we didn't apply here that okay whenever we write something we just switch all the records okay so now let's apply this filter okay whenever we write something it should uh, fetch uh, those records it should just suggest those record which starts with this uh, character that we are writing inside in foot fields so far that just come here what we will do we will add a filter function before this map okay just come here and here we will add filter we will get item here and we will filter all our uh, records okay we will write here item dot title dot starts with uh, uh, our uh, value okay the value is the value data that we have written in input fields now let's check it okay just come here it starts with okay that's okay appreciate and now let's check it okay e it will just pitch those record which start with e okay just pitch those record now what we will do now we will limit these records okay we just would like to display so just five of them okay so for that to Uh, right now there is nothing but we displayed all the records so for this to correct this uh, if this input field was empty we should not display the record so for this solution let's come here and i will add here just value and okay if the, there was something inside the value so then it will display this data to us yeah that's okay let's move remove see nothing else a field that is okay now let's um, just uh, limit these suggests okay so for that just come here to the here okay let's move this map down and here after starts with I will add end item dot title was not equal to equal to with the value and but before performing this action okay we did this okay let's uh, whenever we click uh, and this suggestion we should uh, uh, move this this uh, uh, title to the input fields okay inside here so for that just come here whenever we click on this now I will clear this okay one minute I will clear this and just come here to the div element yeah this div element whenever I click on this on click what we should do we will just uh, um, call a function set value okay we will assign to the value variable e dot uh, no sorry we should assign item dot title okay on which suggestion uh, we click it will move to the variable okay and we set that here in input field let's check it okay see let's uh, appreciate once again let's write n and we let's press this one see that has came here but whenever we click that we should not display this record okay so for this now we will do that okay as we did before let's come here and item dot title was not equal to equal to with the value save it and now let's move it yeah appreciate once again let's come here and let's press this one see so now i will just limit it okay limit the suggestions uh, if i got that option so let's check it once appreciate 
for example i write e so i should do um, see here just for example five suggestions okay so just come here to the code and come here to the before dot map function come here and we will add one another function dot slice okay in here the first one is zero and the second one is five for example we want five yeah that's okay and let's save it and now let's move back see we just saw five again refresh it let's check it okay let's write e see we just got five suggestions so that is working so it was all about uh, how to create um, a search bar with suggestion and filter in react.js i hope this video would be helpful for you if you like this video don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel and like the video thanks for watching